Hello, hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, like, subscribe, comment, share. Thank you guys in advance. You already know what it is, my love. Kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable. Cause we about to make it do what it do does. So we're gonna jump into this read. This is a love channel only. All we talk about over here is regular plain old love. We do pick up on divine connections, family, friends, and karmic energies at times. So take what resonates and leave what does. And let's see what's coming in for my collective, my ears ringing. What do you need to know when it comes to your love life for your greatest and highest good at this time? Collective energy in the love lives. Okay, so there's some type of opposition here. Seven of Wings. Um, someone could have been lying, sneaky, deceptive. Seven of Wings is Seven of Wands, right? Yeah. I believe. But there's some type of opposition here. Somebody could have been trying to block you, stop you. What's going on? The messenger. Okay. So, um, with the princess of wands, there could be a younger feminine energy that was trying to block or stop you. Yeah, from having some type of success here in a connection. Tell me more. Yeah, they had some type of habits. So there's a feminine energy with this princess card. I feel like she's a younger um, energy here who has some type of habits. And I don't feel like they're good habits. They can be bad habits here. And they were trying to block you, stop you from having this connection with your person. That's the truth. Spirit says that's the truth. could be the visionary here like you see things maybe you already know you can intuitively know but what I feel like here is this masculine energy is finally seeing the truth about this this feminine energy here and yeah, they could have married this person or been in some type of commitment or connection with this person Yeah, and they were happy. They were celebrating. They thought this was who they wanted to be with. Yeah, they thought it was going to be a brand new adventure here. Maybe this person was being very generous to them. They were giving them money, taking care of them here. Yeah, sex. It was sex and money. And this person doesn't want to lose the sex and the money. So whoever this, this feminine energy is, they don't want to lose the sex and the money. So they're trying to block this this king of um shells which is the king of cups from coming towards you no this is the king of pentacles i'm sorry y'all king of shells is the king of pentacles so they're trying to stop this king of pentacles from coming towards you this could be um someone who's dating a younger person they could have a younger daughter um a younger son in feminine energy here but whoever this is they got some bad habits Yeah. And whoever this King of Pentacles is, they have been analyzing this connection. They have been looking back over what's been going on and they're noticing this person's bad habits. They're seeing this person for who they really are. The truth is coming out. Yeah. They, they're realizing that you're the Empress, man or woman here, and not whoever this third party was. Yeah, they want to come give you this romance, the Two of Cups. That's like opposition. Yeah, see, you're the realist here. You this, you coming out as the the king of gems, and whoever this younger feminine energy is, they're trying to cause illusions here. Yeah, so your person, look, I can't make it. Your person is now reevaluating. 
the situation. Yeah, they're at a crossroads. So this person is now at a crossroads. This King of Cups, King of Pentacles energy here. They're at this crossroads because they're now seeing this younger person as or for who they really are. They're seeing through the illusions here. They're reevaluating the connection. This person could have also been trying to block you, Collective. Yeah. They were hoping that whatever they did would work. And I don't think it did. Yeah, they were determined to. Now your person is determined to come back towards you or wanting to come back towards you. They're seeing the truth about who this, this third party is. Yeah, they got regret. Disappointment, grieving, despair. I wish I didn't do that. Yeah, now they're getting their confidence. Ambition, free will, personal power, courageous. I'm not able to say no or yes. See, I feel like this person wasn't that confident in the past. They weren't able to tell this person no or yes. Now they're standing in their power because they don't regret. Collective energy when it comes to their love lives. Clarify opposition. Love, love. For my collective. It says bring the tea and keep it on the low. Yeah, so this person was trying to keep it on the low what they were doing, right? Um, low-key secret, hidden information, hush, not showing. You won't tell, I won't tell. Um, bring the tea, the juice, spilling the beans, hidden truth, gossip, leaked information. So the truth was coming out. They were trying to keep the shit on the low. But they were trying to block or oppress this connection. This King of Pentacles here. Clarify the Princess of Wings. So you're about to receive some type of message here. About to blow up your phone, call, text, email, communication arrives. Can we just talk? This female may reach out to you guys. Or this feminine energy may reach out to you guys. Wanting to talk to you because this person has walked away from them. Clarify habits. Yeah. The sex is no longer working. So they have bad habits. They have some type of sex addiction here. With the habits, it says the hammer, intimacy, intimacy sex, hook it up, wang wang, majesty, throat baby, walk. So this person has some type of sex addictions here. They could have been, huh? They could have been sleeping with this person's friends or family too. Clarify the King of Shells. Yeah, told you. Ain't nothing to cut a bitch off. King and Queen of Swords. By Felicia, they're walking away from this person, or they walked away from this person. The sex no longer work. They're they're no longer trapped in this. They found out some truths about what this person was doing on the low. Trying to keep them stuck. Trying to oppress them. Clarify the king of gems. Yeah. There was a third party situation. Told you they could have slept with somebody else. Entanglement. Past life lovers. New lover. Here to challenge your masculine or feminine. They could have found out that this person was sleeping with a family member. Or another masculine energy on the low. The truth came out. It was all an illusion. Your person finna call and tell you. They, they, they cut this person off because they got caught having sex. Clarify the seven of shells. They see the truth about the illusion, yeah. This person is no longer trapped and caught in this illusion. Okay, of whoever the third party was. So when they call you, they're going to tell you that they love you. They have this affection for you. They have this compassion. That they see your worth. Okay, they want unity with you. And they've been watching you. They're secret admired. They want you to be theirs, but they were afraid to tell you how they felt. Yeah, they want to marry you now. Engagement, proposal, commitment, union, eternal devotion. Clarify four of shells. Yeah, they got an activation here. Okay, they went through some type of activation, DNA activation. It says Anunnaki, the fallen ones, reptilians, the controllers, grays. We just want to exist. 
Mantis, the referees, Palladians, we are here for war, the giants we used to rule. This um this person that was trying to hold on to them could have been one of these species, and they now see the truth as well. The person was trying to hold on to them to keep them stuck. And they was using sex, they was using their body, they was using passion. And the whole time they was out here having sex with other people. Terrified crossroads. Collective energy. Yeah, they realize now that they were sleeping with the enemy. Psalms 23, Pharaoh's awakening. I prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies, wolves and sheep clothing. And they're angry, rage, anger, temper, control, aggression. I'm about to fuck everything and everyone up. They, <laughs> The third party is upset because they got cut off because they got caught. And your person is upset because they thought this was their person. They opened their heart to this person. They thought that this was, you know, the love of their life here, only to find out this person played them and was, was using sex to control them and having sex with other people, third parties. Now your person want to come towards you and apologize. I'm sorry. Regret, disappointed, despair, apologetic. Please forgive me. And this third party is begging for your person's forgiveness at this time, trying to get back in, trying to use sex to get back in. Of energy when it comes to their love lives. Yeah, this person got caught cheating. They got caught cheating. That's too many. Let me see what it is though. I'm sorry, wife or husband. Sorry, I don't want kids. Karma connection. Love has arrived. I got you if, I, if you got me. Okay. So this person cheated, right? And they're trying to apologize to your person because they could be married. They didn't got caught cheating. They was in a whole marriage or something long term, right? Not only were they married in a long term commitment, they didn't find out somebody's child or kid ain't their kid. They realize they're in a whole karmic connection here. And this person is going to come towards you and tell you that they're sorry. They realize that they were in love with you the whole time and they got you if you got them. Yeah, they were dealing with a baby mama or a baby daddy. But the, the baby mama or the baby daddy or this husband or wife had this child outside of their connection. Sorry, I don't want kids. That's somebody else's baby. Look, pregnancy, I told you. They got pregnant by somebody outside of this connection. They got caught in the, they got caught cheating because the child don't belong to this person. And now this baby mama or baby daddy is trying to beg for forgiveness, but your your person who done found out this child don't belong to them, it belonged to another man or another woman, possibly their friend or a family. It's coming back towards you telling you that they hope that you guys can have something. Love has arrived and they got you if you got them. They are working on themselves right now so they can come back to you. Okay, so they're not coming back in the same energy. Yeah, whoever this was tried to have a have a baby with your person. Told you it told this person that this was their baby. And it wasn't. It belonged to whoever they were cheating from or cheating with. And now your person's hurt. Now, they abused you, hurt you in some type of way, and now they got hurt dealing with this person. They are going to reach out to you and ask you, can they meet up? But they're still dealing with whoever this baby mom or baby daddy is right now. This person is still reaching out, trying to meet up with your person as well, because they're trying to fix it. Yeah, a whole mistress out here. They was a whole mistress. Some of you guys, they got the mistress pregnant. Others of you guys, they were someone else's mistress. And got pregnant to some got pregnant by somebody that was married, even though they were dealing with your person. So because the, whoever they were dealing with was married, they didn't want the kid. So they tried to put this baby off on your person. Yep, had a whole male side piece. Told you. Had a whole male side piece. And your person thought this was true love. They thought they had a family. They thought this was their connection. They thought wrong. Mm. 
now they're trying to heal. But this was karma. This was karma. They chose the karmic connection over you. And now they're realizing they chose the wrong connection. Whoever they thought was their baby mama or baby daddy is pregnant by somebody in a whole nother connection. A whole nother commitment. This person was telling them that they had them if they wanted, you know, that I got you, you know, if you need me, until they got pregnant. And then they cut this person out. And this person tried to put this baby off on your person. Who did this? Taurus energy. Capricorn energy. Who is this? Air energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Who is this? Sagittarius. Who is this? Aquarius. Who is this for? Collective energy, love life. Aries, Pisces. One more. Who is this read for? Is that it? Maybe we only got seven this time. That's nice popping. We'll go through one more time. One more. Okay, guess not. Bottom of the deck is Cancer. So Taurus, Capricorn, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sagittarius, Aquarius again, Aries or Pisces. Um, maybe the uh, zodiac signs for this particular read. If it resonates, guys, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye-bye, TT babies.